Dude, oh. guess what I'm doing? What are you doing? It's this new app where I can find new co-hosts for podcasts. It's pretty cool. Mm. Yeah. Doing a lot of uh, swiping. You know, Johnny, I've seen your Tinder profile, so I have <laughs> uh, very little worry. <laughs> You're stuck with me. <laughs> Just like in real life, you ain't going to do anything. <laughs> Uh, are you a hinge man now or are you just a gym man? Um, I'm a lonely, sad boy weekend man where you lift after 7 p.m. on the weekends. It's pretty good. Mm, you're called a, sad boy hour. You're a Batman man where you're up on the rooftops at midnight. Someone has to protect those uh, plates from being stolen. So I'm up there every every night watching, waiting, making sure they, they get put away correctly. Mm, I love that, Johnny. Plates don't hurt you. They don't break your heart. <laughs> you sad part that. is he's not kidding <laughs> i once watched a kid pull two weights off of a weight rack at once and it flipped the other side and shattered all these mirrors <laughs> what yeah, it was awesome yeah that happened uh i'm a professional worker i get paid to do this <laughs> and we have a safety bar it's like a squat bar but the handles are in front of you so it's, so it wiggles a little bit and I took off the two plates and the other side started lifting, towering up. And my client had to hold down the other side of the bar. So now I take them off one, grab the other one and take out the other one. If it's over two plates. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Somehow the, the 90 pounds off one side quickly just isn't great. Yeah. It's crazy. Especially on a flat bar. It's not as bad, but something about that safety bar, just cause it's made to wiggle a little bit more. What's the craziest Lesson thing learned. you've seen at the gym? I've seen weird workouts. Um, <laughs> Have you okay. seen those like those trending memes where people are like yeah. using the machine in the completely wrong way? You've seen this in person. Oh yeah. So there's <laughs> the guys, the, the, the member as we gym bros call it um, was an older gentleman back in the day used to do neck workouts, right? Where you'd shift your neck on a machine. Anyway, there's one it's called <clears throat> a lay down leg curl machine. So your stomach is on the floor and you put your legs behind a machine and you curl backwards. Anyways, he had his head underneath the curling device and he was moving his head up and down with the curl. So it's, uh, it looks, I know my law, I know the rules. You don't record other people, but I was so close to breaking every rule I have <laughs> on recording workouts. Johnny, just remember content is key. So I mean, I, it, I it consent is key. We never remember. Oh, it's consent is key. We will consent know in seven weeks from now. Mm, so that's that was a year ago. Crazy. That's why we can't record people. Oh, crazy. <laughs> How people stop and talk to us, I'll never know. But we ask. We asked. Yeah. We only got like three no's not to be on camera out of the 20,000 we talked to. So we'll take it. Seriously. Um, Johnny, in preparation for Fanex, we are wanting to up our nerd game, right? Hmm, we're getting out all the cobwebs and showing our flexing our nerdism. Yeah. And we're testing each other a little bit, right? Like it's yeah. like Sean and Gus getting back into gear. Yeah. Come One on, of the son. funniest things I ever saw was I'm getting back into character. What's his favorite catchphrase? I've heard it both ways, right? Mm -hmm. So they were they shot a video of them getting ready for it, and he goes, "I've heard it multiple ways. No, nope. I've heard it several ways. No, nope. I've heard it both mm -hmm. ways. Yeah, we're just getting the cobwebs out. I love yeah. it. Yeah. So are you ready for some quizzes? All right. So, so let's quiz. explain tonight's what how it came to be our little fun experiment. Mind it, it is an experiment night. We'll fine tune it before <laughs> before we talk to you. Yeah. So what was, I sent you a meme and you were like, that'd be hilarious podcast. Yeah. It wasn't it. Um, it was, uh, uh, Java, the Hutt's perspective of star Wars, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What was it? His perspective is some guy owed him money and he died for it. Wasn't it something yeah. that, <laughs> yeah. Star Wars from Java's point of view is just some guy owes you money. So he sends his friends to kill you. <laughs> yeah. And that I thought that was hilarious. And I go, that's a funny way to look at TV shows, movies, you're not the protagonist. You're just some NPC, but what is the world for you? Yeah. It makes me think of another one. It was similar where it's like from Jarl Bargroff's point of view, where like you're getting these reports of the dragonborn, like killing a dragon and doing all this crazy stuff. And he just sends him on these more and more dangerous quests <laughs> just for him to come back. And anyway, hmm, I'm going to reward you with breezy home. The smallest, <laughs> the smallest home in all the land. <laughs> Okay, um, are you ready for my... So we're going to call this okay. from, a, from a certain point of view is what we're going to call this game. Okay. 
Star Wars. And the premise is you describe it and I have to guess the character or the show. We'll see. Like I said, Knights, we're so on the ball on this one. I really want you to get the character. If you get the show, if you get the show, I'll give you one point. If you get the character, I'll give you two. How's that? Okay. And then how much for a hug? (laughs) You have to get two of these right. I have five of them prepped for you. You Oh, okay. Okay. (laughs) As if I could say no. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Whoa. Uh, All right. All right. From my point of view, I have been a captive for who knows how long. I'm currently being held captive by a major addict whose favorite food is sushi. Eventually, I will be rescued by a kind-hearted rich man who will pass me to his nephew, who will then throw me into a volcano. I hate you. Uh, (laughs) These are going to be hard. Yeah, I wasn't even expecting this. Uh... Uh, okay, the, can we? Can I use a, a a mulligan? Is it a movie or a TV show? So it's a movie. Okay. Let me, let me give you the the highlights again. So you're a captive. You don't know how long okay. you've been this quote unquote captive by an addict. I'm not going to say what he's addicted to because that'll give it away. Um, okay. But his favorite. So the, your your captor's favorite food is sushi. So think raw fish. Okay. <laughs> uh, eventually, you'll be rescued by a kind hearted rich man uh, who will pass you on to his nephew. I don't know if this helps or not. Um, and then this is the biggest part of it that's going to help. This nephew is going to throw you into a volcano. If it if it helps you, Johnny, the nephew and the crack addict are fighting over you and you get thrown into the volcano. Uh, none of this helps. You know I don't know movies as well as you, you nerd. Dude, this is, this is such a stretch, but it's pretty funny. Uh, uh, I'll give you one more deep. hint. Okay. You are a part of someone's soul. So you're not actually a, a character. You're just you're just a mole, uh, MacGuffin, and you're part of it's someone's even, soul. It's even worse. <laughs> and you know I've seen it. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> oh. And uh, people call you precious. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> <Are> you- <laughs> Oh, you little golem dick. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, I don't swear. That that was so good, Jay. You're not supposed to start off like this one. <laughs> so you ah. in the cave being held by Smeagol, who's a who's a major addict whose favorite food is sushi. That is true I'm, fish. I'm really, ah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, you're rescued by a kind-hearted rich man, Bilbo, who gives you to his nephew who throws you in a volcano. Is he rich? So was Bilbo rich? Dude, Bilbo is way rich. His 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 chain of mithril is worth an entire kingdom. That's right. He does he does like people are fighting for it. The the cousins are fighting for his um fortune state. Yeah. Yeah. yeah Dang, Frodo that was good. Like, You're like, good. Bag end is like the biggest property in the Shire or one of them. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you're good. Do you have one for me? I have more, Johnny. Show yeah, me. yeah, yeah. Mine is just okay. <laughs> Mine is too easy now. I don't even want to do this. Okay. Okay. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> and these are just mine are just easy. All right. Okay. Um, you go to work every day. You don't remember what you do. You know it rhymes with something. And you are, you live in Canada most of the time. Is it severance? No, 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 no. <laughs> I don't know what I do. Uh, uh, I don't know exactly what my job title is anymore. Why do people keep asking me stuff? Uh, okay, here's another one, too. Um, you may or may not have appropriately dressed yourself on Halloween. <laughs> is it what we do in the shadows? No. Oh, it's You work Creed. nine to five. It's Creed. Yeah, Creed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the whole like flow said, again. Give me the whole flow again. That was good. Well, so, so you, uh, you go to work every day, right? Cause mm-hmm. he's a lesser known. <laughs> Doesn't know exactly what his job title is. Cause quasi he always forgets. Something. Yeah. Quasi yeah. Quasi something. something. He forgets his quality assurance. <laughs> you quiz and there's me a good. whole, there's a, and I think these are, I've been watching too much of the super fan episodes, the deleted scenes where he brags about spending half his time in Canada. Cause it's tax free. <laughs> <laughs> so he sleeps it at the office three days a week and then he goes to canada on the weekends dude canada threw me because i was suddenly like what's filmed in canada psych is yeah. filmed in canada <laughs> what are we doing the show that's true in canada. okay good i'm glad it a little bit because i'm like if i'm gonna that was the first thing in my mind was creed because i just love creed oh <laughs> okay i gotta stump you again because you stumped okay. me good on that one i thought i was yeah, right you you were like this is gonna be a pub bowl this could be so easy and i was like <laughs> <laughs> these are these are hard 
Okay, this one this one is really convoluted, and okay. I'm just gonna say this movie has not. This is a film, so I'm gonna give you a little hint. This is a film, okay. Johnny, and it's more than a decade old. Okay. Okay. From my point of view, I attacked a witch, was sentenced to death, escaped, traveled to a mystical land with my best friend. While traveling, the witch was killed, so we stole her shoes and danced around a bit. Then we met some friends and killed the witch's sister. Well, that's Wizard of Oz, but are you <laughs> the house? Like what? <laughs> I'm not the house. I'm um, sentenced to death. Remember, I bit her. So who could I be if I'm biting people? Are you a monkey? No. I don't oh, know. Oh, the lion? <clears throat> no. Uh, my name sounds like two syllables put together. Like it's it, it repeats itself. I don't know. I don't know. Think <laughs> think of what little barking thing bites people. <laughs> oh, Toto! Oh my yeah. goodness, that's um, a good one. But the dancing around in the shoes threw me off a little. Ooh, Toto's yeah. good. I, when I say we stole the shoes, really Dorothy stole the shoes. But I figured well, the royal was, we. <clears throat> yeah, you did a lot better on that one than the Lord of the Rings. Was. Well, I it was because that was an easy one. I mean, Lord of the Rings <laughs> threw me because that was a good one that you're a captive. Like that was very, very and sushi. That was my favorite part. Is the minute you say sushi, is it breaks the illusion of this being yeah. Middle Earth. All that no, no, that that that's gonna be. We'll test our fans with that one, Knights. What are your favorite ones after all this, and then we'll test the fans in real time. I like. That. I like this. this all right, I got another one for you. Let's what? Yeah. Okay. You go to school every day. There's this really annoying study group. No. Oh. That takes up all the space. Okay, I know the show, but I need to know. I need to know. Yeah, who I here, am. here's a kicker. You ready? Mm-hmm. For some reason, they wanted me to play Dungeons and Dragons with them, and they didn't want to play ever again with me, but they <laughs> kept playing. Make him fat. <laughs> <laughs> you know how to do Neo. Neo. <laughs> uh, mm, bonus points if you can give me the name of his like family in D and D, like his house um, or the. Sword. Okay, ready? It's it's. Du Duquesne, dude, I couldn't remember. That's yeah. totally it. It's House Duquesne, Sword Duquesne, House of Duquesne. Dude, Hi, I am. What is, I forgot his name though. From House of Duquesne. <laughs> what's, his, what's his character's name? Dude, I couldn't even remember Duquesne. Yeah, I remember Duquesne because he gets the Duquesne sword. <laughs> I steal his sword. That sword, and it's funny because that was my first eye opening of D anD D, which is <laughs> not how we play D anD D at all. But it's just funny no. to like reference that like that took me 10 years and 400 campaigns to get that sword i'm like what (laughs) that's crazy i am of house of duquesne i forgot his name uh but yeah i want to do a community one because there's just a lot of lesser characters and do and we just love doing neil is he neil duquesne does he just go by neil no no no, he doesn't go by neil he goes um it's something didasaur like no a trade he's better at making up names like than abed mar (laughs) <laughs> I'm gifted in other ways. <laughs> okay. From my point of view, I was drafted into a war where I, when I befriended, sorry, when I befriended where I befriended a handicapped dude who used to be crippled. So he's still handicapped, but he used to be crippled. Uh, I died during the war. So then this man through the power of prayer bankrupt my community, but through that grew extremely rich and shared those funds with my family. <laughs> this Forrest Gump. Yeah. <laughs> The Bubba? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking of I was thinking of Forrest Gump, but then I was like, wait, no, who would it be? I for saying I thought it was a sergeant, but I'm like, no, he was fine before, but he didn't help his family. Yeah. <laughs> that one was dumb. That was a good one though. Like nothing's gonna beat my the stuff I was doing. Okay. I, the next one I'm really proud of, so I want to hear yours because I'm really excited about my next one. <laughs> oh, look at you go. Uh oh man. I keep throwing away these other ones. Uh, no, you don't watch that one. That won't work. Sorry, I have like a few of them here that I, I've been You're watching good. a lot of a lot of lame things that I'm embarrassed about. So uh, it's a little embarrassing. We don't want to go do it. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. Broad spectrum on this one. Okay, it's more like a sector. But from your perspective, your life is about your dad who goes nine to five. He's amazing at home. He's your hero. But all his coworkers seem to make fun of him. Oh, it's it's scary, Gergich. Yeah, so it's one of his daughters. <laughs> uh, I'd have to think of what her name, Melis, Melisent Gergich, Melisent. 
I'll go Millicent. Yeah, I'm not sure. I thought one was like Gretchen or something. Um, I don't know. I love that his daughters are so all super hot. So like, yeah, Chris, my beautiful Chris like, wife. I do not want to go. I do not want to go out with you and your daughter to dinner. And he sees her and he's like, I reject the offer. I I will go with you. Well, my favorite is Ben Wyatt trying to figure it out for three years. Like, is she? Is he a clone? Does he not know what's going on? It, drives, it keeps me up at night. Don't think Was about it. She it hypnotized, and if I say Alakazam <laughs> or hypnotic, she just, <laughs> just wake up screaming. Uh, <laughs> it's a great show. I had to do one of the the, the, the three hierarchies of our of our past parks, community, I, and, and uh, office. I don't know if you've noticed a theme, but you've done pretty much all shows and I've done pretty much all movies. Oh, I mean, that's how I was, I was going to keep it. I had both, but I figured you're the movie guy. I'm the TV show guy. We've always ran with that. Mm, kind of love that. Yeah. That's how we symbiotically are still together after a decade. <laughs> okay. Here's one. Here's your next one, Johnny. From my point of view, I was sent as an auditor to determine the liability in conjunction with a new vacation destination uh with a fun twist so a new vacation destination with a fun twist okay oh while i know what it is tr- what is it no, no keep going keep on i want to hear it all. Okay, okay well on this trip due to, a, due to a power outage one of the main attractions goes sideways and eats me while i'm on the toilet <laughs> uh is it i know it's Jurassic park is it samuel l jackson no it's not not sammy it, oh is it, it's it's uh newman no it's not newman even ah that's a good one though but it's the yeah. lawyer i don't know his name oh yeah i'm not too huge in him yeah the uh, the he surveying gets on the toilet remember when you that's gotta right. go you gotta go jurassic <laughs> park is a good show i like it dude it's all right i've told this story before quick tangent everyone before we get back to the game but liza and my wife uh wanted to see jurassic park during covid when they'd shut down everything and so we're there you know no more new movies are coming out so theaters are showing old movies so we go and see Jurassic Park. And I've seen Jurassic Park tons of times. But um, I haven't really watched it all the way through in a minute. Um, and I had some scenes mixed up in my head. So there's a jump scare that I had mixed up. Anyway, so in the middle of this theater, like pretty well crowded, um, the raptor jumps out of the lady as the power is turning on. And I wasn't expecting it because I thought it came at a different time. <laughs> and so so the raptor goes, Arr! and I scream. I go, ah! the theater like and normally i don't do whatever but it scared me wow i just let out this like huge yell and then all i can think about for the rest of the night is like do these people think that i've never seen jurassic park that like <laughs> <laughs> because my reaction was so like so loud and audible um anyway okay that's that's my story is a, a 15 year old movie or whatever no i think it came out in 1996 seven or six. Oh yeah yeah it's so it's almost like 30, 30 years now yeah, yeah. yeah. so a 30 year old movie i'm like screaming during <laughs> so like, this guy not ah! seen it yeah basically <laughs> like even and you jumped. have to do that you do the gus and, and sean like high pitch like ah! i wish my throat can't get that high oh you gotta practice <laughs> I don't want my it. next one i want it yeah i need you gotta, it. You gotta have me, it daddy. give me ryan howard <laughs> <laughs> he's a main one though that's a hard one okay <laughs> From my perspective, my computer always breaks down. I call downstairs and they never answer. And when they do, it's the same oh, no. Irish man who yells at me. Hold on, Johnny. Can you give it back to me? It, it, it had a restart real quick. Sorry. It had a total okay. like freeze. <clears throat> okay. Back to one. <clears throat> okay. So from my perspective, I work in an office. My computer always crashes. I call the IT. Oh, I gave it away. Ah, bird. You got it in <laughs> my head. Gonna, I heard the Irishman. I was going to say, yeah. that's all I heard. All I heard was Irishman out of the, when it froze. I was going to yeah. say, hello, Jen. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, let's start I'm over. Douglas, I got another one for you. Am I Douglas? Oh, I was just going to say just a generic worker. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought it I was... try to get non big protagonists on these, like not mm. the, like the A cast, but no. I got to, I'll, I'll, let's redo one. Ready? How about with that one, Johnny? What we, we when we quiz someone else on this, we should say that we uh, we should do it from like those girls' point of views where where Roy. Oh, is the hot girls desk. from from uh, what is it? <laughs> floor bunny. six. I think it's floor four, but I think maybe okay, maybe it's six. But yeah, when when he's a desk bunny. <laughs> <laughs> um, that was my IT crowd one. Okay, let's let's give me another one. Well, I was just gonna do this one's a little tough. Yeah. Just because you have to really pay attention. 
because you don't know a lot of it, but you know a lot of it. Anyways, so from my perspective, it's a bunch of kids I went to high school with. I thought I was their friend. I wasn't. I haven't seen them in a long time. They invite me over some of their shenanigans, and I end up homeless. Yeah. Is it man seeking woman? No, but you're on the right um network. <laughs> give it give it all to me one more time. Okay. Okay. So <clears throat> your perspective, it's a bunch of kids you went to high school with. Okay. Uh you got roped into one of their shenanigans. Uh shenanigans is choice because it's a Irish area. Anyway, and then uh that probably helped you not helped you at the same time. And then you, um, after helping them, you end up homeless. I have no idea. Give it to me, son. You are in love with one of your classmates' sisters. Johnny, who I'm is... so lost. <laughs> and their hangout place is owned by all of them. But for some reason, uh, one of the owners is also the janitor. Dude, all I Here's the biggest giveaway. Is, Their yeah. hangout place is a bar. Is it always sunny? Yeah. <laughs> oh. But what character? I have no you idea. Were, you were a uh, man of the cloth, and then they ruined you, made you homeless. Is it that? Uh, is it the guy who plays Riggity Mary? Cricket. Oh, Riggity Cricket. Is it the guy who Riggity plays Cricket. Mary in, uh, in Psych? No, 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 no. That's one him. of the oh, Boyle twins or Boyle people. <laughs> Okay. No, he is in the um, Mythic Quest TV show that's uh, done by Mac that I really like. I think that there's one more season coming out. It's on Apple. Someone else was. Oh, yeah, but you're rickety cricket. That. When you said Irish, I thought Dairy Girls, and then I thought Scooby Doo. For whatever reason, I was like Scooby Doo. Yeah, I know. It's because it's you, uh, it's an Irish pub, right? That's, yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> their their pub's an Irish pub. That's my Sunny reference because I know you know Sunny, but you don't know Sunny. Right. <laughs> that was good. I've only you know got one clips more Johnny. Okay, that's perfect. That was my last one. Okay. From my point of view, I joined a gang at a young age, much to my mother's delight. We had declared war on the government, and my brother fought for the other side. My gang leader asked to borrow my pet slash servant. So that's the big giveaway. It's, it's a pet slash servant, <laughs> which is a horrible way to describe it. But uh, he, he, so my gang leader, he left the pet slash servant for dead and injured. Thankfully, my boy returned and showed me the evil nonsense the gang leader was up to. As a final FU, I gave my life to help destroy my boss's jewelry, and I hope my effort wasn't in vain. Hmm. This one's a stretch. <laughs> the jewelry... Oh. Is it Thanos? It's not Thanos. That's, oh. a, good, that's a good guess, though. Yeah, I was just thinking of jewelry, and then the, it would have been one of his daughters who has a pet. Uh, movie, I'm assuming. Yeah. Oh, wow, we really did stick to a... <laughs> uh, so you joined the army. Your mom's happy you joined the army. So not an army, a gang. Gang, sorry, a gang. And we all have the Knowing same tattoo. Knowing you, it's probably... Is it a, was it a shark or a jet? <laughs> I'll, get, I'll tell you this. jet? We all have jet? the same tattoo. And I have a pet. <laughs> You're not a Goonie. No, dude, this one is really hard because I'm very much a side, side, side character that you ever never actually meet. You just hear about his death what? later. Yeah. Uh... I'll give you another, I'll give you a big hint. My pet slash, uh, my pet slash, what do you call it? Servant tells the main antagonist my story because they're looking for this jewelry. A pet? <laughs> slash servant that serves yeah, me that's still that, weird, and can though. speak and it, the, that can, it can speak but it's not human <sighs> and it's been serving my family for generations Jar Jar? <laughs> no oh, um, I'm trying to think of something that won't give it away I'll give you my initials if you want them yeah might give it away though yeah, I'm, I'm really stumped on this one. This one's, this one's a hard one. Mm-hmm. Mm, I'll give you a hint. I was killed yeah. by some in Fury. 
I was drowned in a ca- in a cave in a lake. <laughs> this is really hard. Yeah, I feel like it's something I've never seen. You've definitely seen it. I know, but like not really seen, pretending to see. Uh, what universe am I in? Is it MCU? Uh, no. No. Uh, uh, something, something dark side. <laughs> All right, let's. Let me, I'm trying to think. The problem is, is any more of my hints are going to give it away. Um, hmm. This is super niche. I kind of, I kind of like it. It's definitely not niche, but well, the character is. But the the yeah, 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 yeah. But it's the biggest book series of all time. Oh, I'm already out. <laughs> is it Dobby? It's not Dobby. It's creature. Oh. Well, creature's the pet. Creature's the pet that i'm talking about See, creature is like See? so <laughs> i'm just gonna give it to you is that okay yeah yeah Rimulus articulus black so it's serious black's <sighs> younger brother <laughs> why do you do this to me <laughs> dude that was you know so hard you know my you know my harry potter head is very like generic i can play the game i can speak it i'm not extremely as fluent like you ah. so so dumbledore and uh Harry, go and get the locket, right? Slytherin's locket. That's one of the Horcruxes in a in a okay. cave. Does this sound familiar? And they have to drink a potion. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's that's on the Death Hollow. Yeah. Uh huh. Well, it's on uh, Half Blood Prince, and and then oh, again okay, okay. in the Deathly Hollows. Well, in okay. in in it, they find like the wrong locket, and it, there's a note from Rab, which is Regulus Articulus Black, who switched the lockets. Anyway, but I always thought he was a tragic character because he's go through he goes through all this effort, but it was really like a pointless gesture, like or nothing. Yeah, because then they have to go get the locket from the ministry anyway. So, dude, this happened to me yesterday. My uh, client had a Harry Potter water bottle with a ton of little decals and stuff, and one was uh, it was a it was a quote, and she's like all excited. She's like, "Ooh, who quotes that?" And I go, "I don't know." And I felt so bad. It was um. It was Dumbledore talking to Snape about something. I go, uh. <laughs> was I'm it like, about I'm so, like... I, I wish I knew it more. It was something <laughs> like, it's always black or it's always right. I can't even remember. I just remember being, A, it was 6 a.m. It's, <laughs> I'm stumped. Liza said, like, unless, a... unless you're talking about, like, I don't know. I'm, like I said, I'm, you know, I'm very shallow end on Harry Potter stuff. Yeah. I watch it every year. I feel like you need, need needs to be watched during Christmas time. When it's cold outside. So let me ask you this. Who's the best Harry Potter character? Um, um, I'm, I'm trying to blank. What's, uh, what's, uh, Batman who died? The, oh, the, uh, the... Cedric Diggory. Yeah. I liked him a lot. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. going off like the, the main, like Cedric. Yeah. We're going off the main, um, <laughs> yeah. One, Cause shut up, Johnny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's the best. <laughs> He's he's your favorite and mine. Uh, probably Dumbledore is my favorite because he <laughs> he's nerd. just the worst. <laughs> uh, there was a funny tweet. All right, last thing we'll end on is this really funny tweet where someone said, "I thought long and hard about why Professor Dumbledore would hire uh, oh what's his name the second year professor uh, Gilderoy Lockhart." He's like, "I thought mm. long and hard as to why he would ever hire Gilderoy Lockhart," and the only conclusion I've come to is Dumbledore thought. Oh, this is going to be hilarious. Because <laughs> there's like, he's I, the worst human. I was trying to think of one for Harry Potter, and maybe we'll fine tune it where it's like, you're a kid. You're like on, you're like on the Ravenclaw. You're in Ravenclaw. And you're like, why do these people come back every year and they're almost about to die? <laughs> like your perspective is that you're just trying to go to school and this these other houses are just causing shenanigans and you're like i just want an education and every year your your exams are canceled because of the the main character and <laughs> and then you're like yeah who why is who keeps letting him back in the school like who keeps letting harry back in the school and the and the professor is giving like major brownie points to him and letting him win last minute well and, and then who him. keeps taking the dark arts class there's a new teacher every semester and it always <laughs> sucks you're like <laughs> doesn't that tell you inconsistency yeah there's a lot of funny ones on that one they're like who's to blame for the parents for yeah the parents sending their kids back every year like oh you almost died ah, go back next year <laughs> um okay cool i like that game a lot we'll have to we'll have to quiz some people on that at fanic so we'll if someone watches tune it yeah, they're gonna. Nerd, yeah, if you watch it and you get it right, there might be a prize in your in your favor. 
<laughs> in your in your in your favorite sites sure yeah <laughs> johnny um let's jump to another game if that's okay we're gonna end this cast we thank you so much for watching it um nights let us know what we missed what what and let us know stump us when you see us walking around on fanex try to stump us you probably will but stump, come stump it- us if you put a character in the comments, Johnny and I will try and guess who it is too. Yeah. If you made it this far and you put a character like how we did in the comments, we will try and guess who it is. And if you stump us. And if us, we get it wrong, again, there might be some decals in your future or a shirt. I got some cool and random nerd shirts. Yes. <laughs> All right, Knights. Let us know in the comments below. Quiz us, stump us, and we will catch you on the flippity flop. Flippity flip.